Hey y'all, and welcome back to I'm Just Saying TV. Uh, long time no see. Uh, happy 2020, y'all. It's been real, <laughs> but um, yeah. So I am back on my channel, a new revamp style channel. Um, not gonna hold you long. Just gonna let you know, nothing bad happened to me for the past two years. I've been away from YouTube. I've just been living life. I've been taking care of some personal goals that I wanted to accomplish, got those done, and now I'm back to my hobby. But I also want to revamp my hobby. <laughs> like I used to just randomly vlog and just do different things throughout my house or vlog me and my daughter on our day-to-day -day adventures. But now I want to dive more into the things that I'm passionate about. I love fashion and I love to try to inspire other people to want to look good and feel good and um so yeah that's what this channel is going to be about it's going to incorporate fashion for the most part but it's also going to be like a lifestyle channel where i'll be incorporating things about beauty health fitness um even things like home decor how because uh, i'm so into home decor now these days as well so just damping i took down all of my old videos um i replaced it with this new one so it's just gonna be this one video for now um my new upload schedule will be every saturday morning 8 a.m central standard time so be on the lookout for that um that's my schedule right now because i do still work a full-time job although i no longer go into the office i work from home but i still work a full-time job so that kind of gives me a little bit of wiggle room to not stress myself out about putting up videos but it also gives you a constant schedule of knowing when to look out for my videos and be on the lookout for those weekend Saturday morning uploads. So with all that being said, let's get to why you guys clicked on the video. I am going to show you how I am styling my new hauled wool Rachel Zoe trench coat. <laughs> y'all, let me show y'all this coat. I went to TJ Maxx last weekend, not looking for clothes or anything, but I did go to get a uh, Christmas decor and stuff for the house. But of course you can't go to TJ Maxx, which is a TJ Maxx home goods in my area. You cannot go there and not peruse the clothing section. So well, I can't. <laughs> so I went over and just was looking at sweaters and little coats and things to see what they had, you know, there. Not that I needed one, but y'all, I spotted this Rachel Zoko. Y'all, and for the price, let me show y'all. Y'all see that? $29.99. I'll wait. Girl, I was sold. I love it because of the tan neutral color that it is, and it can go with so many things. And I love it because it's a trench style but it's actually like lightweight, like a sweater. So it's just easy to layer with things and it's not super, super warm because I live here in Texas and in Texas, we don't have really, really cold falls and winters. I mean, it gets airish, <laughs> is that a word? It gets a little cool, but it doesn't get freezing cold. Like we don't have snow and those type of things here for the most part. So I wanted something that I could layer and still look stylish and chic, but not too hot, easily pull off and you know throw it across my arm go shopping you know that kind of thing i didn't want a big coat last season i had a, a teddy coat that i rarely even pulled out to wear because it didn't get cold enough here to wear it so i still love my teddy coat but i was happy to happen up on this gym i love it so much y'all so it's a wool vice coast viscose blend i don't know how to pronounce it but anyways you get what I'm saying. So I'm going to show y'all about four or five, maybe four ways that I would style this trench. And if you like to see that kind of content, don't forget to subscribe and keep watching. Okay, so here's a casual vibe that I'm going to do. Um, I'm just going to be putting the coat on with my cropped sweater that I actually got last season from Target. Um, also, guys, just know that I will leave a link to everything down in the description box below. But 
here I'm just going in pulling my sleeves down because eventually in a minute you're going to see me uh, hike up the sleeves on the coat. I like to do this with my coats because it makes the outfit look more stylish. It doesn't just look basic like I just slapped the coat on and ready to go. It gives the outfit a little bit more interest in my opinion. Um, And I'm going to be pairing this look with my little booties that I hauled recently. Um, stay tuned for these because I will be sharing these with you guys in an upcoming favorites video. So be on the lookout for that. But yeah, so I paired my cropped um, crew neck sweater with high-waisted jeans. And the jeans are embellished with slits on the knees. I think they're so cute. And And now I'm showing you guys my bag that I would carry, one of them. I just pulled this one out for the video, but I recently purchased this bag. Um, it's Batchley Mishka. I love, love that deep mahogany, uh, I think it's considered cognac uh, color of the bag. Here I'm just showing you, I'd probably wear this crossbody like I'm styling it. Now here I am wearing my melanin hoodie and some sweatpants that I recently got from Walmart out of the men's department, y'all. Don't sleep on the men's department. And shout out to the Unfrumpy Mommy Life store where I got this melanin hoodie from, you guys. Y'all need to check her store out as well as her YouTube channel. I'll leave a link down below. I'm rocking it with my New Balance sneakers just to give it like a more casual run into the grocery store type of vibe or just out running a quick errand in the cold right quick next is my distressed sweater dress y'all i love this dress one for the color two for the style i got this dress from Fe um uh, was it forever 21 last winter uh well actually i think it was like january of this year but it was still winter um, I love the tone untone color combo that this is giving me. Um, monochromatic is what most people call it. This look is everything to me. If I was going on a date night or out to dinner, I would probably wear something like this. Yes, guys, I love this. So cute. And again, I'm trying to do the hike up my sleeves for the added effect of style. And I have my over the knee boots on, which I got from Amazon. I love this look, you guys. It's so chic. Okay, you guys, last but not least, this is a work outfit. Yes, this is work attire for those of you who may still be going into the office. Like I said earlier, I am working from home, but if I was going into the office, this is something that I would pull from my closet to put on on any day of the week, except Fridays, because we dress casual on Fridays, and I would probably wear something like the first outfit. <laughs> but yeah, these vibrant green pants, you guys, I love them. I'm pairing them with some nude pumps, um, skin tone colored pumps, cognac. And to offset the look and the color of it. And this is just a bodysuit blouse that I also got from Forever 21. Here's some options of the coat with scarves. This is the first scarf. The color is so pretty. It's going to have the green so well of the pants. And another option would be this plaid um, cream and browns and burgundy colored scarf. It's a sweater scarf. I just love it. It's so cute. It's giving me all the fall and winter work attire vibes. Very casual. And very sophisticated. And very work appropriate. <laughs> 
And again, I'm pairing the bag. I'm showing you if I wore it on my shoulder or in the crook of my arm. Yeah, so I'm loving that outfit for work. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching the video. I hope you enjoyed the content that was brought to you. I had so much fun filming it for you guys. If you do like this kind of content, make sure you think about subscribing. Oh no, don't think about it, girl. Go ahead and do it. Also, leave me a comment below letting me know which outfit was your favorite. Which one would you be likely to try if any of them or whatever, or all of them? Um, I just wanted to give a little bit of different options for you guys. So don't forget. I'll upload every Saturday, 8 a.m. Central Standard Time. Turn on your post notification bell so you don't miss another episode. I'm just saying.